Hey Chicka Pies, how we doing? How we feeling? TGIF Friday. TGIF Friday. TGIF, y'all, thank God it's Friday is what I was trying to say. If y'all can't figure it out, I am just this, I am just off my rocker today. So I tried vlogging several times today. I went to go get a Sonic drink. I tried vlogging. I felt like it sounded like I don't know. I just wasn't together. And then they did, they were out of lemons at Sonic, which totally threw me off my rocker. I was like, how do you be out of lemons? Like, who does that? So I had to figure out what other kind of drink I wanted. I ended up with a pineapple um, berry slush, which is okay. It's just a little bit on the sweet side. So I wasn't real thrilled about having that on the sweet side, but it, it'll do. And then um, I'm holding something in my hand because I want to talk to you guys about it. So anyway, so I ended up just scratching all that footage and just said, you know what, just forget it. Why am I even going to try to post this? It looks stupid. So I didn't. And so then I sat here in this drive through I'm actually waiting at KFC and I tried vlogging when I first got in line, but of course I'm trying to read the menu and I'm trying to talk to you guys and it was just a hot mess. So I scratched that footage. So this is like take 10, okay? So um, yeah, so I am actually sitting in line and I'm waiting to, for my food, which gives me a little bit more time to chat because it is a little bit of a line. But um, did y'all know that KFC wasn't selling the grilled chicken anymore? I have not been here in a long time and I tried to order it at another, KFC and then instead of them telling me like they didn't make it anymore like as in it's not available They just said we don't have any right now and I was all like well Why would they be out of it? Like what's with that? But this lady just told me they literally don't make it anymore. So I just learned something new I'm not really a KFC connoisseur, so I didn't I wasn't aware But now I am so a little bit disappointed though because I really wanted the grilled chicken versus the fried but I'm getting my vegetables. I ordered green beans instead of uh, the mashed potatoes. So I'm getting my vegetables. So that's better than nothing. So yeah, so anyway, um, I wanted to share with you guys a little bit of uh, something that I got in the mail from Amazon. I don't know what video it was I mentioned, but it was nail polish that I had on my nails. Um, not the navy blue that I just took off my nails, but the nail polish that I had on before that, which was called Nude Dude. New dude or new dude. I can't remember which the proper way it's called. And of course, I'm not wearing my glasses, which I have sunglasses that are reading glasses, y'all. And I don't know where I put them. <sighs> but, um, okay, I don't want to. How are you doing today? With um, the green beans? Yes, please. With the K five, be careful with that lid. Man. Okay. You have a great day. Yeah, that's fine. Thank you. Okay, now that we got my food, let's chat for a minute, shall we? I'm on my way to my girlfriend's house and I'm gonna be doing her hair. Um, and for those of you, I, I'm sure I've mentioned this on my vlogs before, but I sew in tracks um, for like personal friends and I do it occasionally for like, um, you know, various people oh man come on car come on car okay this truck's just gonna have to wait um and make a little money every now and then but it's not like something that i'm not like racing out to do you know what i'm saying so um but yeah so i'm on my way to my girlfriend's house to sew in some um tracks and um gonna be a fun night of it so we're not having margaritas tonight we're gonna be sewing in hair so that's what I'm doing tonight but um, getting back to what I, I wanted to just I want what I want to share with you guys is so um, when I that I had two nail polishes from Milani that I've had for years when I say years I've had them for probably none less than five years I I mean I don't 
I want to even say more. Like, I honestly don't know. I know I've had them for a long time. I, five years sound like totally insane to say, but I do know I've had them for a long time. And they were the only nail polishes that never got, like, gooey. They never got, like, I mean, and they seem to never run out. And I felt like I wore them a lot because I always liked them. So I was always like mesmerized by the fact that they just did not, I mean like I'm like is this bottle like a refillable bottle and it just fills up on its own or what? So anyway, then I kind of like stopped using it for a while because of course some funky colors came out in other brands and I went through this phase where, I, you know, well I say phase but like I like, I love trying any type of polishes. It's not like I'm like oh I'm going to be vegan or oh I'm going to be you know, oh, the cruelty-free nail polishes or whatever, not being vegan, it's the food. But um, I, I just like to kind of find out what's out there and I will try things based on colors, based on that theory that I want it to last forever. So, um, tried all, a lot of other kinds and the other day I was like, you know, I don't know, I was like, I'm, I so much love blue and green nail polishes. My two favorite colors of nail polishes in the whole wide world. If it wasn't for the fact that I feel like I, I mean, I could wear every shade of green and I can wear every shade of blue every single day and it would not, I would not be upset of myself. You know what I mean? Um, but I tell myself, like, I feel like, okay, I had on blue last week, wear a different color. Or I had on green last week, put on a different color. So, that being said, the other day I was like looking for a blue nail polish. Like I was like, I don't know, I want, you know, well I was looking for a nail polish. And then I kept, I found myself just being drawn back to the blue. I was like, you know what, I'm just gonna get the blue. I'm gonna be happy with the blue because I want to wear blue. But then I was like, you know, where is that Milani blue? That's such a pretty blue. It lasts forever on my nails. Went searching through my room and I found it. Well, the bottle is darn near empty. The, the refillable bottle has finally run out. So, and it was a, a little bit, tad bit on the like gooey side, which I kind of chalked it up also to the fact that I, I don't have AC in my room right now because you know, I know our AC situation. So my little room is not been the most comfortable place to be. And I kind of felt like, well, you know, it might be just kind of gooey because it's been sitting in the heat or whatever. So anyhow, I was able to paint my nails with it. And I actually, I mean, it came out beautifully and it lasted pretty good and all that good stuff. But of course, it got me to thinking, like, it's completely out. What am I going to do? Like, I can't be without this. I just can't. So, I got on Amazon. And, well, first I looked on the Milani site because you guys know I've been buying my Milani um, foundation. Which, I, you know, I, you haven't seen that haul video yet because I haven't posted it. But, I did get my Milani foundation in. And, um, so I didn't find it on their site. Their site's not really, like not a lot going for it but um yeah I said it Lonnie if you happen to hear this video because I just feel like they could have put a little bit I mean I know it's a very inexpensive brand but I just feel like their site is not user friendly it wasn't I don't know it just it's 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 very simple when I say it's not user friendly it's just it's almost so simple that you just kind of look at it and you don't even feel like going any further you know what I mean I don't know but anyway so I was like okay they don't have it on their site so I thought well let me just check Amazon and see, like, you know, they everybody always says you can find anything you want on Amazon. And lo and behold, it was there. Now, I did see a different Amazon carrier that had the nude, is it nude dude? I don't know. But, um, and it looked lighter than the bottle, like, and I was like, oh, I almost want to try that just to see if it's a different color. Because, you know, like, sometimes when they remake things and then they, uh, like, uh, Pacific Blue, when they remade that, they remade that a different color, and a lot of people don't like the new color. I, I mean, it's okay, I do prefer the old color, but I do like the new color, but the old color just had a little something something in it that just, you know, stood out, I guess, far and beyond everything else. But, um, but yeah, I'm just rambling away, y'all. So anyway, um, all of that being said, guys, I found it, and I also found the green. So, um, the green, I don't remember what the green is called, but I found the green one also. And I was all, almost going to be like crazy and like buy two bottles each. And really, I had them in my cart and I was like, girl, okay, if one bottle lasts you, if, you know, like probably five years, 
why are you gonna buy two? Like seriously, like come on now. So I ended up putting um, only one in the cart, like taking the others out of the cart, and I only have one each. And I ordered those, and they came in last night. Well, they came in, um, they came in through the mail, and um, they sent me a notification, which I hadn't checked the mailbox, and. Um, I got a notification this morning when I woke up. It was like they delivered them like an hour ago and I ran outside to look at I was like, Amazon delivers this early in the morning. But um, I guess when the post office workers go to work from the day before, that's when they log in, what they deliver the next day, things like that. So Amazon had record that I had, um, that was delivered like as if it was just delivered, but it was actually put in my mailbox yesterday. So, um, so yeah, so I love it um, having, I, I mean, they both look exactly the same, which I, after I saw the one that was a little bit, dis, the coloring of it looked like a little bit different. I was kind of like, oh my gosh, this is, you know, I, like I was wondering like, is it the same or, you know, or is it going to be a different polish altogether? But it was the same polish, so I was so, totally stoked about it. Um, and I'm going to show it to you in just a minute if I can ever get up on this little wrap here. Oh, and by the way, guys, my AC is working. I got AC. I got AC. I got AC. Yeah. So, like, it was nothing wrong with the Freon, which is good because that would have meant I had a leak or something. Um, the guy said that he thinks something was loose. He tightened a little hole, something other or not. And I was good to go. So, perfect. Um, so, anyway, so let me show you these nail polishes a very, like, quick, like, if I can. Y'all, I gotta do this with one hand. Can I do it? Can I do it? I'm kind of like on a way place where I, it's not the traffic's not cray cray or anything. So these are the two nail polishes that I was dying to have. They are neon colors by Milani, and they are the most beautiful colors ever. And if you guys are into these colors, I am going to recommend these with the highest regards. Like I'm, you know, like I when I tell you guys I've had this nail polish for five years. I know it's been at least five years because I don't even remember. Like, I can't. It was before my grandson was born and he's four. He'll be four in July. I mean, I, it's been longer than five. I'd be willing to bet money on it. And they have lasted. So, the longevity of this nail polish is amazing. And it does last on your nails, which neon colors don't normally. And that's why I think these were just so... They stood out to me so much because every, in fact, I think these were like the first neon nail polishes I ever purchased ever. Like when they, like I don't remember ever purchasing anything before this. And so I remember thinking whenever I would buy nail polishes that were neon, I know I have my headset hanging on my head. Y'all probably look a hot mess. But um, whenever I would buy uh, neon polishes, I would always freak out and be pissed because they wouldn't stay. And I never understood it, but I think it was because I was always comparing them to these. And these work like none, no other. I promise y'all, they work like no other. Like, I don't know what's in these polishes, but they last forever. Now, I do do numerous of things to my nail polishes guys like I'm not one of those people that just throw on nail polish and walk out the front door I I you know I treat my nails I clean my nails I you know I do a lot of stuff to my nails which I know aids into the ability of staying power to polishes like you're making sure you have a clean bed your bed's not oily all of those things are very important so yes I do do those things so if you don't do those things I can't attest to how well the polish is gonna last now I do use my Sasha V as my top coat, and but back in the day that didn't exist, so I wasn't using that obviously. Um, but I did do it this time, and I was amazed at the singing power of it because I literally cleaned, washed dishes, and everything, and the polish did not even chip. It chipped the next day, which I thought was so funny. And when it started to chip, though, it chipped like a mother, like it went ballistic. But you know, hey all good because I had been cleaning and I knew it was time to take it off anyhow so I was all good with that oh look at here I get the park I get valet parking y'all not really but um so anyhow love love the both of these have I showed them to y'all yet I was trying to drive and talk and all that good stuff let me try to get this car parked okay my headset is about to get on my nerve because I have it on so I have to talk through it for right now y'all so forgive me 
but um so anyway these are the two colors this is the blue which is the new dude or new dude or whatever and i want to say this is something jade or i'm not real sure i don't remember the name of this one and i don't have glasses on and i can't see either of them the names to be precise but i love both of these guys go on amazon it's the milani neon and if i if i can figure out the whole lincoln stuff guys i will link it in my description box bar because like i love both of these then of course you know i'm looking at milani nail polishes and y'all know i have a problem when it comes to nail polishes because i love them just that much and i saw these and i was like okay this one's a neon one and i want it so so much it has a 50 percent off sticker on it so this one's like three bucks or something like that guys it's called stuck in the 80s I still get the stuck in the 80s it is such a beautiful color though like I'm gonna pull this off like I am going to pull this off but not only am I going to pull this off but look at this one this is called peacock now this one is not a neon this was is like I don't know it's a Milani it has a, a different color lid so I don't know if this a I don't know like when this came out or what it represents or anything like that but I just like the color it was called peacock and I was like beautiful on a piece of paper at work today I put both of these colors side by side and guys talk about being beautiful so I am going to be doing a mix and mingle or some sort or something with these two colors together because I haven't done that in a long time and I just love the way they look like I have to do that so I'm at my girlfriend's house and I need to get in because I need to get started on her hair because it's gonna be a long long night and I probably won't get to see you guys anymore tonight unless I happen to chat with you guys on my way home tonight which means it'll be pitch black dark so I probably won't but you guys um, if I don't talk to you again have a fantastic weekend or evening I'll see you guys over the weekend I have to go to the baby shower and all that good stuff tomorrow and I got my AC so it'll be fun going to the baby shower now I can drive my own car and be happy because at first I was like oh no oh no oh my god okay my battery is dying did you guys know that like I, I can talk out of battery in some no time flat Okay, this is all my crap that I got to take with me in the house because I'm going to change out of my clothes. I have to tell you guys about what I'm wearing, but um, at some point or another. Uh, okay, I don't need anything out of that bag. So I can leave that bag in here. But yeah, so I got me some food to take in there. I got a lot of crap, y'all. Why do I have so much crap? Okay, so I'm going to set this over in here. But I'm going to go ahead and get off now, guys, and I will chat with you guys. Like I said, maybe I will try to say, hey, what's up at whatever time in the morning I leave here. I don't, do I still have lipstick on my lips? I have to talk about this lipstick because this is those lip smacker stuff with a pencil. And I kind of like it. But we'll talk about that later. Anyway, get in here, girl. Do your thing. And I will chat with you guys later. This polish I have on was just a quick throw on polish last night because the blue was so chipped. And I didn't want it to look like totally tacky at work today this top is a top that i picked up at zara's you guys will see that in the vlog that i post probably i probably won't post anything until in the morning because obviously i'm out and about today but i did buy this uh yesterday and it was seven dollars and 99 cents and it's so cute it really is a dress but of course like it's a, it's a little short for work so i couldn't really pull it off as a dress for work today so i have it on with my leggings and I so like it with the leggings. I feel like the leggings, these leggings feel hot and thicker than my other ones. And they're my Hue leggings. So I gotta go, I need to find some new leggings. You guys, can you send me some messages of some leggings that you like to wear? I know I hear a lot of talk about Lululemons. Have any of you guys ever worn those? Like I want the real truth. Like I don't want somebody trying to sell them to me so they can make money. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> like I want the real truth. Like are they any good? So, but yeah, I want some leggings. I don't know, like I, I'm in need of some. So anyway, I'll show you guys at some point my outfit, I guess. I don't know, you might not get to see it, but um, I need to take some, I haven't done Instagram in a while. We need to talk about Instagram, but not right now.